Hi, this is Diane McConaughey at Remax Select Realty, and today we're going to tour 1788 Hassam Road in Moon Township. 1788 Hassam Road is actually a part of the Londonbury community. In fact, this home was the model for Londonbury when they were built back in the late 1960s. Um, it's a great residential community. As you can see, the flowers are coming in. You've got neighbors on either side of you, and the home is actually located close to I-79 and um, I-376. You'll notice as you come through the front door that you can go in a couple of different directions. We'll start off to the left, which takes you into the very spacious living room or family room, whichever you prefer. Hardwood floors have been very well maintained by the original owner and all of the walls are very uh, neutral color throughout the house. You've got a great big window in the front uh, that lets in lots of light. Then we go through into the dining room, which overlooks the rear yard. <clears throat> and then right from the dining room, you can walk right into the spacious kitchen that has been updated with all stainless appliances, gas stove, microwave, dishwasher, and uh, refrigerator. There's also room in the kitchen for a table. Uh, and seating area. From the kitchen, we will go into, again, either the, um, um, from the, the front hallway as well, the family room or living room, whichever you prefer, does have a fireplace, uh, has a little closet on the side, and it also has a door leading to the rear deck. Um, and as we go out the door, you'll be able to see the spacious rear yard uh, that actually leads down to the walking trail. And that's a great trail that'll take you through the Londonbury community. You also notice to the left of the deck that you will be able to uh, park cars for visitors. And there's also a two car garage, uh, integral garage. As we walk back through to the main entryway, off to the right is a powder room. And then right outside the powder room, there are two closets. One can be used for storage and the other can be used as a coat closet. You'll notice that there's lots of storage throughout the entire house. So a nice big coat closet here. So now we're going to head upstairs to the second floor. Again, it's hardwood floors um, throughout the second floor as well. They've done a great job at maintaining the floors. Um, but here we have one of the uh, very spacious, one of four bedrooms. You got two windows and two closets in this room. And then we'll head on over to the master bedroom, which is also spacious with a couple of windows on each of the walls and then it has its private shower it's a walk-in shower this uh, bathroom also has been updated as we leave the master bath you'll see that there are two closets for the master bedroom then we'll head on down the hallway on the left you have a second bath or a guest bath which does have a shower and bathtub. You've got the handicapped railing, tile surround. And then headed to the third uh, large bedroom again, you've got the windows on both sides, both sides of the room, which is great. It adds for a lot of light in the room. Lots of closet space in that room as well. And then the fourth bedroom, and again, hopefully you're taking note of the great hardwood floors, large closet there as well. The basement is unfinished, but it does have a lot of space for storage, or you could have a play area for the kids down here. It does have a utility tub, washer and dryer, and it does have a door leading to the outside, it just goes out to the rear yard. It's a furnace and hot water tank. The owner had wall anchors installed on the front wall of the house at the end of 2019. And you'll see that the wall anchors did continue into the garage as well along that front wall. And there have not been any issues there. This is a nice spacious garage, two car garage with lots of storage.
and that concludes our tour today. I hope you enjoyed it.